fact, FOB segment tonight, as we reported last night, some powerful people are raising big money for Hillary Clinton's presidential run already. And it seems that Mrs. Clinton herself is trying to get ahead of the curve. You make these choices based on imperfect information and you make them to, as we say, the best of your ability. You know, my, my, my biggest you know, regret is what happened in Benghazi. Uh, it was a terrible tragedy, uh, losing four Americans. She's very emotional about it. With us now, the dynamic duo of Monica Crowley and Alan Combs. So, is she just saying that, <laughs> or does she really feel the depth of the disaster? I, I think both, actually. Do you really I think, do? You yeah. think she feels bad? Well, I think she, first of all, I think this is a very self-serving comment on her part, the regret. I think she feels regretful that it happened on her watch. But and she has to feel bad for the ambassador and his family I, and for I, other Americans. I, I tend to agree with you. Has However, I think her big, reg her actual big regret should be twofold. Number one, her department denied multiple requests for additional security when that security situation was deteriorating. Right. Requests made by the ambassador serving under her when everybody knew that Benghazi was overrun with Al-Qaeda and other terrorists. But he did turn down personal security that was offered from another source. Okay, but what struck me, Combs, was she's flat. Even when talking about... She didn't say it the way she should have? Maybe. Is that it? Oh. I, I didn't see a lot of empathy <laughs> oh. there. She can never make certain people happy, no matter what she does. I think that's true. I mean, I think she didn't say it right. The words weren't exactly but, right. Uh, did you see a lot of empathy there I in that little chair? I think it was chair? good that she expressed regret. If she hadn't said it, you would have had a million conservatives say, why did you mention Benghazi? I mean, she can never make some people happy. Right, and I agree with you that everything that she does is going to be criticized, just like Barack Obama, by some people. That's true. Now, my question for you, Combs. Did Hillary Clinton, in your mind, ever do anything wrong? Did she ever do anything wrong? Correct. <laughs> Well, all of us have done things in wrong. the public <laughs> arena, Combs. In the public arena, yes. I mean, I, I, she's never been president. She's only held public office as senator for a short time. I wouldn't say she's done anything wrong. Okay, I can't, so you have never jumps seen at, nothing jumps out at nothing me. jumps out at you, Alan Combs. That's correct. There's nothing, not one <laughs> thing that you've ever seen I mean, in I'm public arena. I'm going to make you happy that, if I don't say not something she's happy. done wrong. I just want an honest opinion. I think she was a good senator. She was a very good secretary of so state, I and I do not have an issue at the moment with Hillary. Okay, Clinton. I want to be clear that. In your experience, you're a New Yorker, okay? That's correct. And Mrs. Clinton has been in a public eye now. I tell you what, I will come up for about I don't, 25 years. I don't years. think she should have. I don't like her support of the Iraq War. I think that was a mistake. I think it was a mistake that too many Democrats voted for the Iraq okay, War. It was a Iraq horrible War. mistake. Anything yeah. else? Well, it's the first thing that comes to mind. I mean, okay. you know, yeah. I mean, that's a big one. That's big. Because I don't think okay. we should have been in that. Room. I can give you a whopper. No, I don't right want now. one from you. Oh, well, you here's what I want from you. Okay. <laughs> Has Hillary Clinton ever done anything right? Oh, that's a very thought provoking question. Yeah. Bill I mean, I'm I... giving you the same jazz I'm giving him. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> um, give me off one the thing. Top of my head, something that she has done right. Yeah, correct. Anything. Testing, I Bueller, anything? <laughs> no, I can't. Right? I, I could fill a volume with what she's done wrong. Do you want to pick another category? <laughs> yes. How Thank about you. potent potables? All right, but this, is what I, this, is, this is what I mean. This is what I mean. But you're both partisan people. That's why we have you on. We want to have the lively discussion. But you don't think critically about your well, that's not person. True. Well, you you do right not here. think critically about her. And you're just looking to whack her a couple of times. You well, know? no, I mean, she's done so much wrong, namely lying to the faces of the Bengal. The families oh, of the ridiculous. four who died. She kept up this lie for weeks what on lie? end that it was a spontaneous demonstration as a result of a video. That to me overwhelms everything. And even sure. if I could come up with something positive that she has done, the fact that she oversaw this horrendous event that, by the way, she used the word tragedy. It is a tragedy for the families of those four, but for the nation, it was an act of war. This was an act of terrorism against the United States. She, That's what she should be talking about as her that. biggest she regret. She used the word terror. That's not absurd reaction to Hillary Clinton, who did not lie. Ever. Benghazi is not a scandal. Benghazi is a tragedy. Republicans have tried to play this since before the last presidential election. It didn't unseat Barack Obama, and it's not going to hurt Hillary Clinton. It is a ridiculous well, why, thing to keep why doing. Why now it. is she engaging in this kind of preemptive language? Because I think she knows it was very it's smart of her to do it. Because her. she knows that people like you are going to beat the bejesus out of her everything for the next she, four years. Everything she does is very strategic. So what she is starting to do now, especially with Benghazi, with what you just saw, Bill, was this idea that she could put out there, she She's addressed it. She's taken responsibility, whatever, whatever the hell that means. And now she can say it's in the past. It's old news. So when it comes up in 2015 and 2016, she can 
and say, I already dealt with that. This is what the Clintons do, and they do it very well. <laughs> but you got to stay on it because this thing keeps unfolding. Right. You had a bipartisan report news. that said it's it was her department. She's, She's running, right, Combs? She's, She's running. running. Of course She's she running. Is. She's running, right? Of course yes. she is. Okay. All right. So at least we all agree on that. <laughs> we agreed on one thing, everyone. I am the master diplomat right here. <laughs> is it legal? <laughs> on deck. It